Howdy everybody, I'm Sam Feifel. I'm the editor of sparpointgroup.com here at Spar Europe in The Hague. I'm here with Marian van der Hoek from Spy Nederland and you're not wearing a name tag. No, no, I lost mine. <laughs> lost mine. <laughs> well, tell people who you are. My name is uh, Nico Deuk from RMT Solutions in the Excellent. Netherlands. Thank from you. Netherlands. And so what we were talking about today is uh, using technology to solve real problems and you know, not worrying as much about the technology, worrying more about the problem. So you know, what's one of the problems that you've seen you know, your customers struggling with? Yeah, well the first thing we have to mention is that we are uh, our guest here from, uh, from Sphereon who's using the technology, but we're coming from a point that we are serving our customers. So we listen to what the issues are at the customers and one of the critical issues at this moment is compliance, mm -hmm. compliance uh, with regulations and safety issues. Because we just had a big example here where a big oil terminal in Rotterdam was taking away their license to operate mm -hmm. because they could not prove any of their documentation and, and the certification of, of their in technical installations. Sure. Well, so how can we use technology to solve that problem? How can, how can they show that they're compliant using 3D technology? To make sure, uh, we, we need to make sure that, that, that all the documentation that covers their compliance is, uh, is that's now spread all over the place, that is linked to a visualized system. Huh? So they can actually zoom in on the, on the actual item they are, they are talking about or they, they need to prove the, the compliance of and they can grab the, the documentation they need out of the picture, out of uh, their documentation system and show it. So, I mean, why is that, that 3D helps them do this? What, what does the visual component do that, you know, just having a good database system on your computer doesn't do? Well, it's a visualization. And as you can see, that there are a lot of subsystems where all those information is available. And it takes a hell of a time to gather all these different subsystems and make it to one report, for instance, to the authorities. And with making this 3D visualization, you simply walk into your plant, you click on your equipment, and all the information, which is spread around behind it, but nobody has to worry about that, is right available at any time you want. Mm -hmm. And that makes a difference. Yeah. So it's embedded in the quality systems of, uh, of our customers, so they can prove it to the authorities, and it's very easy to handle by using this uh, 3D visualization uh, technique. Yeah. Well, whenever I see uh, a solution like this, you know, it, o it always looks great. You know, you've got it all set up to work wonderfully. But what I always wonder is, how long does it take me to get to that point? You know, I I've got to tag all of these items. I've got to take the scans. I've got to take the photos. You know, how do I? How how long does it take in time to get from? You know, I've got my documentation in file cabinets and in files all over the place to something like this where it's organized and I can just click on something. Now, the advantage of this, of, uh, this system is that, uh, that the, the visualization is one and, uh, and all the items you need to tag is another one. And the, these are all grouped in a database, eh? SQL based. Uh, uh, it, is, it is possible to link that database to any other foreign database and s simply uh, 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 suck the data in and then link them. So if you look to a, uh, into a plant, it is, takes less than a week to make a complete uh, complete documentation set, including visualization of a plant, of a, a plant like this, what we did here. Wow, less than a week, that's fast. Less than a week, yeah. That's great. Yeah. Well, uh, I think you can see that uh, you know, 3D data is being used to solve real problems in a plant environment. Thank you for being here. It's a pleasure, thank you. Appreciate your uh, time and energy today. And thank you all for watching. We'll see you next time on sparpointgroup.com.